do not own the copyrights to any music you may hear. Dollar General Remodel Penny Shopping is the best penny shopping there is. What are remodels? Watch my videos. How do you find remodels? Watch my videos. Don't have time to find your own? Make sure and comment on every video that you watch. Super Sunday Sweep, Miss Carrie, will do the searching for you. You pay a low fee once a month for the entire state or states that you shop in. So, make sure, like, subscribe, Comment below, what states do you shop in? Weekly Drawing. You can find Super Sunday Sweep on YouTube, Facebook, and Telegram. I am so sorry. I forgot to include the self-checkout in the last video. And I absolutely love using the self-checkout so that I can show you all that I am actually getting these for a penny. Now, I apologize, I usually cannot get you the shopping video and the haul video in one because I shop all day and I don't have time to do a whole video when I get home. So, you know, I apologize for that, but believe me, it's worth the wait because you know that I'm actually paying a penny, I'm actually finding these items, and I'm not just saying that. How do you know if your store has already done the DG, you know, good and smart reset? Well, one clue. So, a lot of stores have the section right here that I talked about. And you'll see that they still have the DG better for you up top. But all of this is now juice. You will not see any good and smart other than like our juices. This used to be a whole section of the good and smart food. I'm gonna check over here too. And see, you're going to have your basic. You're still going to see good and smart mixed in with some of our stuff. But literally, you know, there were, I don't know, say 50 items, give or take, an entire section. And now that section is gone. So, um, most of the stores that are considered 
I don't know, the DG Fresh. They're going to have the newer store layout where there's a divider in between the register and the aisles. Um, whether the register is on the left or right, it doesn't matter. Um, it does a little bit, but most of them, if you walk in and the register is on your left, then your snacks and beginning foods on the right, and this is going to be your last aisle before you run into these aisles. And then the ones that have the register on the right, it's like a complete flip-flop. So see it's on that side and then you would walk in and it's like these aisles here and your pop and stuff is on the left and then your good and smart is that middle aisle all right store number two dollar general any food let's hope it didn't pull or people haven't already been here. I have not been here lately at all. Holy clearance. Excuse me. Wowza. Okay. Oh. Oh. Oh yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. Let's see what we got. Yes, more tortilla chips. I need tortilla chips. Of course, I bought a bunch for the parties. <clears throat> oh, goodness, and applesauce. Come on. Come on, come on. Okay, calm down. You know I get really excited about food, right? Come on, internet. The internet's really slow today. Mm. Killing me. Killing me, internet. Killing me. Okie dokie. Do you see it? Oh, I'm so excited. We've got a cart full. Um, so, I was in the Dollar General and I had a cart full of food and I had already hit store one score, right? It just so happened self-checkout was available. I always try self-checkout first just because it's easier, um, less questions, less confrontation, whatever it may be. So at the second store, it's my cart full of food with some of our favorites, you know, the applesauce, the apple juice. Penny food is a huge thing for me, as I'm sure it is for you all, because I have a family. We all eat. Okay. So I go up. The self-checkout's closed. Okay. No big deal. You know, I'm just like, okay, I've done this a million times. No big deal. No big deal. Register. Awesome. Scan. I look. Price. Scan. Price. Scan. It stops. She types in $3. Price. Scan. Full price. Hold on a second. Why? Wait, what? Stop. What did that just ring up? 345. You didn't type in the price? Well, I had to on the previous one because it wouldn't scan anything. 
Like, okay. So I hand her one of the, I think it was one of the s'mores packages. And I'm like, will you please scan this? And she scans it. And I watch it. Because you can tell if they override prices, okay? It's going to stop. First of all, you're going to see it scans a penny. Or it runs through the register a penny. So as soon as she scans it, it's full price. It's not coming up a penny. It's not even coming up half off. So I apologize. And I'm like, okay, I'm sorry. I thought they were, you know, on sale. I thought they were da 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 and she apologizes and whatever. And she's like, well, what are they scanning? Maybe I can honor that price. And I'm like, I don't think you can honor that price. And then she's like, are these supposed to be pennies? Close. You know, I just kind of played it off because you don't want to. But yeah, so here's the issue. I do not know if you go on Sunday morning to one of these resets or, I mean, what are we going to call this? Let's come up with a name. I love calling. I like making stuff up. So um, D to the G refresh the fresh. Anyways, these resets of the good and smart food in my location, you had to go through self-checkout or it came up full price. It didn't even ring up 50% off, like the stores had it tagged at some. So my next store, I did score. That's what this video is, um, partially. And I had the lady, I'm like, after I already paid and everything, I asked the lady already standing at the register, hey, I'm like, I'm doing like an experiment. Um, could you scan this on the register and tell me what price it comes up? Which oddly enough is not that crazy right now because you know, Dollar General was in, it has been in all the hubbub of prices, right? The wrong prices. They don't have stuff marked right. And then people are paying higher prices at the register. So really that whole thing makes total sense. So she scans it. Sure enough, it scans full price at the register, not the handheld, not that, don't let them pick up the handheld. I'm saying, because on the handheld, it may have rang a penny. I don't know. But the register and the self-checkout were not the same yesterday. Sunday, July 2nd, DG Fresh, Good and Smart Project Resets. The penny food only rang up a penny on the self-checkout. And because of the self-checkout system, they rang up full price, but then it deducts everything except a penny. So make sure you watch. If it scans $3.99, don't flip out. Look at the total because it'll say $3.99. Then it will have minus $3.98. And then your total is going to be one penny. But at this point, you need to go to self-checkout only if it's available. And then... And these stores should all have self-checkouts. These should all be newish stores. And by newish, I mean in the last few years, once they started coming out with the good and smart, okay? And so they should all have self-checkouts. You've got to go through the self-checkout. And I don't know, other states, it may be different. Um, but I had to let you know. And I don't know how to tell you ahead of time if self-checkout is closed. You don't know until you get in there. And mm, I'm trying to think. I don't know if you could do a pickup. I don't know. Let me think on that, okay? And I'll let you know. But DG Fresh, Resets, Dollar General, Good and Smart Food, Healthy Food. You know, they started building stores around it. And now it's got to go too. So thank you, Dollar General, for your continued penny blessings. We appreciate you. Except when you throw everything in the dumpsters, because that's not right.